podcast today I'm going to be talking about the new Rainbow Six Siege operators. As you know, the new operators a long time ago was Buck and Frost. And this one right here, Frost, the uh, defender, is absolute OP. Th- this gun right here, this is called the absolute demolisher. Is it's, it's a wrecking ball. <laughs> so only I could put an ounce it, and then this nine film is C1 is pretty bad. Not pretty bad, it's pretty good. But Super 90 was OP, and then they patched it. Thankfully, d- they had to be patched. But today it's not about those. It is about these guys, Blackbeard and Valkyrie. You get them five days early if you had season pass, and if you don't have season pass, you can buy from 25 thousand of an ounce and that is a lot I've only got five thousand and I spent loads I had about a hundred thousand because I didn't need to spend them and things are pretty expensive on this game not to be not to be not to be like um uh, not to be I can't remember <laughs> um so we'll start with Blackbeard so Blackbeard has two Primary, like everyone else, the MK17 CQB. Let's just get a full picture. It's very. It's a nice it's a good gun. Not gonna lie, it is a good gun. Just my attachments on this gun, I would prefer is ACOG silencer, eh, if you want to grip and anything else. No, just ACOG grip and silencer with a nice little gold camo and the charm. Next gun is the SR25. Let's just get a full picture of this. And I have the ACOG muzzle. I can't remember what it's for. Compensator. And vertical grip. And obviously the nice little gold Rainbow Six Siege camo and the R6 gold little charm. Next they have D50 handgun, both of the operators have this. It only has one attachment, it's under barrel with stick, but you do not need this at all. It's a beast. It's a hand cannon. It is a hand cannon. This thing, Rex, is basically a one shot. It's it's a shotgun in your pocket. OP. And for your two secondaries or lethals, it's breaching charge. You need that. Stun grenade. I wouldn't really use that unless if you're with a team who you stay with. And then moving, well, let's go to details and statistics. Oh no, not seeing those. By I mean. Background Jason grew up in a comfortable upper middle class family with no military his- history. So his family had nothing to do with military. He decided that he wanted to be a Navy SEAL at a young age and devoted his life to achieving this goal. So since he was like really young, he wanted to be a Navy SEAL. With the help of his father and kin Solodge, his professor at the University of Washington, he started training at 12 and enlisted in, enlisted in the Navy at 18. So he became in the Navy at 18. Training, Navy diver, basic underwater d- demolition SEAL, training airborne jump school, search and rescue swimming, CQB courses at Quantico, Navy SEAL, um, notes, none, relevant experience, supported role in a country piracy operators including the Marist Alabama hijacking in 2009, deployed in Afghanistan, took part in the raid of MV Morning Glory in Libya, so that's all the facts, if you want to pause it and read it all, there you go, it's just notes at the bottom, so pause the video if you want to read that. Um, headgear, he has, oh, I actually have one, dust line thing, it's pretty nice, pretty simple. Then he has the black ice, the DLC before, and rhino. Rhino's pretty nice, I'm going to try and save up for that. Moving on to the second operator, her name is Valkyrie, and she is a defender. She's OP as well, she is absolutely OP. Her loadout is an MPX, and I have 
I have holographic sight, compensator and paracord grip on it with the golden camo and R6 gold. And her second weapon, well, uh, her second destroyer, as we should say, is the Spaz Traditional 12. I, I, I only put a holographic sight on it with the gold camo and R6 gold. With the D50 in gold and her lethals are deployable shield and nitro cell. I would really put nitro cell on because they have had a big buff. Bio, let's go on to our bio. Background, Olympic hopeful in the 200 meter backstroke, so she was a swimmer. Castellano Snow split her time between the pool and the army base. Her father was training officer. Her junior year, Castellano broke a ram in a car accident, putting an end to her Olympic ambitions. After high school, she, has, oh, she enlisted in the Navy, serving four years before attending college on the Veterans Affairs Bill. Upon graduation, she returned to the Navy, Navy and a career intelligence officer. Uh, training, Navy Intelligence Specialist, University of California, San Diego, Bicello of Science, Computer Science, Navy Intelligence Officer, SEALs Training, BUD, NSW, Basic Conditional Combat Diving, LTW, SQT, I don't have a clue what that means, and Navy SEAL. Relevant experience, after basic training, Valkyrie was assigned to the 10th Fleet's Intelligence Team SEAL Delivery Vehicle, SDV Qualified. If you want to see, if you want to read all of that, um, just press pause. I read most of it. I just ripped in phys physiological profile. And to be honest, these are guys are OP. No doubt about it. They will be hated upon in games. Valkyrie, not so much. I would like to see her dedicated into like the competitive side of Rainbow Six Siege. But if you want to be a proper douche, you can be, be Blackbeard. He, it's just too OP. That's just my final words. Too OP. The amount of times I've said OP in this video is about 12. 20. I don't know. But they are OP. Their guns do a hell of a load of damage. Their, far, their armor, I think, is just... I think it's just... Yeah. The armor is too. Speed is too. That's probably the best you want. Her armor is too. Speed is too. They're OP. They're OP. <laughs> yeah, that's all I have to say about them. That it's ridiculous how it is. It's like games can't be perfect. The games can't be perfect. End, end of line games cannot be perfect like you can't make a game perfect this game is still in a work in progress it's been out for about a couple of months now about 10 months came out first of December do the maths if you want I cannot be bothered but they're OP it's, I wouldn't say they need to be nerfed but I think Blackbeard should be nerfed with his shield but Valkyrie she's fine as she is she's just you need to be tactical when you're near her. Blackbeard, you just need to be nerfed. Sorry, mate. Blackbeard. <laughs> so, I'm going to leave the episode there. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. And put in the comment section below if you want me to do any other of these operators like Pulse Castle, Buck, Thatcher, Montage, Twitch, or Thermite. So just put that in the comment section and I will see you in the, in the next video.